They already had six fast break points, George. They were pushing it and getting to the basket with ease. I don't think you're going to see a whole lot of that with the Pistons tonight. Better to put him on the free throw line than let him get a dunk or a layup. Certainly. Missed the first one already. Makes it a good foul unless Rodney gets in foul trouble. And he had to do it. I agree. LeBron against Damian Wilkins. He's excited about the challenge. LeBron to the lane. Corner feed to Bosch. Long gunning. Got it. Chris Bosch with a triple. Chalmers double. So is LeBron. Bosch open for a minute. More string music for Chris Bosch. On against Damian Wilkins. Gonna put some body on him. LeBron up gunning and it's around and it's off. The wire, but the extra hustle is what allowed the Pistons those opportunities. Look out though. LeBron loose inside. They go inside to Anthony, and Joe L. Anthony hits the hook on the court now. Let's see what happens. Only 3.2 in the 24 for Miami. LeBron with a long two, won't go through. Challenge and put some pressure on Miami's big people at the summit. LeBron keeps the basketball, backs in, turns, fires, fills it up. LeBron with five. LeBron against Austin Day. Steps back, line drives it, hits it. This step back is a step back and a half. Hard to recover defensively. Step in front, steal by LeBron. He's only got Rodney in front of him. Spins up off the glass, got it. But not to foul or grab him. Haslam for Bosch for Miami. LeBron backs in, half hooks, misses. Greg Monroe had the rebound, lost it. LeBron shot won't fall. Battle underneath. Greg Monroe had it. LeBron took it away and laid it in. I think Joe Anthony had a hand in that too. He had a terrific first half. Pistons were able to cool him a little bit in the second quarter. Miami goes deep to LeBron. Nice job of running the lane hard, beating everybody down the floor from Damian Wilkins, who is an offensive threat in this game. We said he needed to be. 58-54, you're right. He's against LeBron, makes it miss here within three. Eight to play in the third. LeBron down the lane. Two to play in the third. LeBron to the corner. Wing bounce to Chalmers. Long gunning, got it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, LeBron stuff. James, another star here at the Palace. Foul, Austin in the ball game. As Rodney Stuckey picked up his fourth. Inside goes Miami again. The drive. LeBron got the first free throw on the Wilkins foul. His third. Pistons are in the penalty. Miami with only two team fouls. Three and 53 to play in the third. things that were lacking a little bit as teams started to slant toward Greg Monroe defensively. Foul. I love 80s. 377 0 100. I go to Pistons.com. Damian Wilkins thought about it. Greg Monroe fires off the rim. Rebound. LeBron James 20 seconds to play in the third. He in the heat with a three point lead. But a nice third quarter for the Pistons. Now we're inside 10. Now we're inside five. Three seconds to LeBron for three. What a killer hoop with nine tenths of a second to play in the third. Damian 11 and 21 to go in the game, folks. Pistons within six of Miami at the Palace. It's been a good game all night long. Cutting inside is Miller, though. Eventually, LeBron was able to work it into at least a couple of free throws. He's just so strong and big when he's backing down like that against fellow small forwards. Comley gets the first. It's 85 to 78. LeBron has 23, Bosch 22. The clock, 
Austin lost it in the air. Jonas gets it back, loses it in the lane with the shot clock running out. Numbers for the Heat, alley-oop to LeBron from Cole for the throwdown. And now Miami's up 10. 8 and 58 to play. The Pistons will take a timeout. It's 88-78 Heat by Max Seal and Austin Day. Five on the clock, steps back and fires. It rims away. Miller tapped it in. Set is still up at 16. Lob inside. Bosch fumbled it. Brings it down. Lays it back up oh, and in. Sure. LeBron Shane Battier, Bosch, and Miller and Chalmers on the floor. They go inside to Bosch. He converts. LeBron with two big free throws, got the first. Minute 19, still up on the clock. Now the 21st turnover could be a killer. LeBron, though, lost the handle on the drive, though. We're going to get a piston foul. I'm not so sure he was fouled. See well, what happened. Kind of uh, allowed to get a running start. Austin Day called for the foul. Not a popular call. LeBron ties the score with the first. You don't want to give him a running start like that where all of his momentum is going to the basket as you converge over to try to contest. He gets the benefit of that whistle almost all the time. Working against Bosch, drives him, flips it up, hangs on the iron, won't fall. Rebound LeBron James with 9.4 to play. At this stage of the game, maybe the Pistons get lucky here and he misses one. Well, he's 11 for 12. He's due to miss one, you'd think, but not the first one anyway. He's been shooting them clean tonight. Now Miami's up two. The Pistons do not have a timeout. This so, would make it a three-point game. Will Miami foul? They're acting like they will. So important here to block out and not anticipate a make if you're the Pistons. Get a strong seal out. 